Hi everybody, so welcome to making hummus. So you need chickpeas, tahini, olive oil, salt, two cloves of garlic, and lemons. So put it all in a blender. If you don't have canned chickpeas, if you can get um, dried chickpeas, um, you can soak them overnight in water and salt and they will come up just like these. However, with being in lockdown alert level four for a while, I could only get canned chickpeas. So either way is good, as long as you can have hummus. So you just put everything in together. Now, if you like your hummus not so oily and thick, what you can do is use a little water just to thin it out and see how that is, just so you can get the consistency that you like. Everybody is different. Not everybody likes the same taste. Let's just taste that. Mm, that's quite delicious, actually. Needs a little bit more blending. So the water I use for my hummus is kangen water. Um, I find it brings out the flavour more in things. Um, I used to use a lot more oil. However, with kangen water, the flavours are just so delicious. I just use kind of water to thin it out now. And it could do with just a tad more lemon juice, so we'll just put in one more small lemon. The garlic and salt are quite perfect. But you just do this to taste, so just keep trying things, changing things, um, if it's too lemony, maybe water it down a bit or put some olive oil in it, um, yeah, so just do it to your taste, add little bits as you go rather than trying to plonk everything in and then seeing if you like it because it really doesn't work very well that way. Okay, let's give this one more big blitz just to get all those other bits a little bit finer. Oh, beautiful. That is absolutely beautiful. So um, I'll pop the recipe up, and if there are any other dishes you'd like me to make, just let me know. Thank you for watching.